who you see in this painting is also the Buddha of the center, the cosmic Buddha Vairochana, the radiant one, the sun Buddha. So at first glance, when you look at this particular painting, it may look like the cosmic Buddha Vairochana is simply within the midst of a field of a whole bunch of random Buddhas. But it doesn't take many hours of examination and analysis to begin to find some very interesting and important patterns. Let's take the blue Buddha Kshobhya, because there is one of him here, and see if maybe we can spot some of these patterns. Uh, here's a good example right up there. See if you can spot any blue Buddha Kshobhyas around him. If you look for a few minutes, you may be able to determine that those blue Buddha Kshobhyas are all arranged in a diagonal line, which made us think when we first saw it, perhaps the other Buddhas are arranged in the same way, and as it turns out, they are. Each one of the five differently colored Buddhas is arranged in a diagonal line, and when taken together, they make a pointed shape over Vairochana. Interestingly enough, it is precisely this pointed shape, it's called a Kutagara, that Vairochana delivers his teachings inside of. So we have a very interesting intersection between text on the one hand and image on the other. Oh, <laughs> 